Hope your Christmas had been warm and truly good family time with one another, ladies and gentlemen. Another episode will bring you something really cool this season. Now with this season comes joy with some really cool offers from various studios and you might be wondering on what to go for, which add-on can be ideal, what airport, sceneries, missions and this video is all about the best things you can get today. By the way, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button as it can greatly help us. Now before anything, let's bring out the sponsors. FS Academy is a good starting point for all of us, helping us get more familiar with how things can take place in different areas. Now with the help of a real airline captain David, we are fortunate to see some good training on this platform from VFR flying, IFR training, jetliners and more. A good opportunity to get engaged in every step of the way. There's a great sale that's ongoing till the 4th of January and take good advantage of this with a cool 40% off. This gives us step-by-step -step directions with a series of flight tutorial missions, making our experience seamless. Now the manner of split the add-ons are based on aircraft, types of them, airports and several other types of add-ons. Now almost a thousand items are on sale, yes, you got a good deal on everything you can think of. Now under aircraft, I've categorized into different types of aircraft here. First off, one of the things that caught my eye was from Enables. The P40F features the latest CFT implementation. Now the behaviors of the legendary Marlin engine has been modeled in good detail, offering us some good responses in terms of behavioral characteristics. It comes with a fully functional EFP including maintenance page, moving map, radios and weather information, plus the option to take the EFP off, trying to keep it more authentic. Next stop is the F-35 Lightning from India Fox Deco. This was and is one of my favorite jets to fly on. I love it on VR. It's great on performance, plus all three variants are great, A, B and C. This is an American family of single-seat, single-engine, all-weather stealth multi-role combat aircraft, where the purpose is to tackle both air superiority and strike missions. It's a great deal if you ask me, I spent plenty of hours on this jet. Captain Sims Boeing 777-200ER, setting at $18 from $30. It's a good deal if you ask me. Now moving to the classics on the commercial kind, DC-6 from BMDG. Now this aircraft was $60 and it's right now sold for $45. DC-6 is a great aircraft, a good classic variety. Now towards Stoll, we have Zenith Stoll, $9.99, Simwork Studios. I think this is the best deal so far, 67% off and I have no count on how many updates we've received on the single pairware. Now this team, Simwork Studios, have done a great job overall, plus it feels great to fly on this. Likewise, with other models from the same studios, Kodiak 100 at $19.99, $20 from $35. The RV14 if you prefer this sort at $9.99 at 50% off. Pretty much all three are great buys. Now moving to airports, there are a few developers who have done a great job making some airports with great detail yet making sure that we don't get affected in performance, I'm talking about FPS. Now one for sure is Orbex. If you take a look at the range of Orbex airports, they have great discounts ranging from 30% to 38%. A lovely set of airports this team produces covering a range of destinations. The same manner you can check AUC out as well. They are a great team with a similar discount pattern. Plus I've been enjoying the Yai Aris Rock Airport. I hope I got the pronunciation right. Plus the Southport Airport, Howe Island, all of them running around at 30% off. Digital Designs have some nice airports on sale here as well. Fly Tampa with the Las Vegas bundle at 30% off. It's a good team by the way. Fly Tampa Boston Logan Airport at $12 from $20, almost $20. We have any scene as well, we have MK Studios. Now MK Studios is one of my favorites as well, including the Helsinki Airport at 40% off, Lisbon Airport at the same price at 40% off. We also have Sierra Sim who do a great job on airports as well, Northern Sky Studios. I've featured many of them, pretty much almost all of them. And there are a number of developers out there actually, but a few good ones whom I can think of at this moment. Now towards another set of add-ons would be Mesh Terrains, this is my favorite part. Here's why. When you pay for something, you get to use this all the time. I love mesh terrains and prefer to cover regions slowly. Now Orbix came out with three mesh terrains, sorry it was four. New Zealand, Alaska, Himalayas and South America. If you ask me, this is such a great deal folks. Mesh terrains can truly be engaging because you have better elevation data and detail. I mean imagine while you are on VR, you can see sharper details while you glide on a Disgust 2C slowly. And you get to truly appreciate what nature is all about. 
650 for three regions being Himalayas, Alaska and New Zealand. Now for South America, there was a lot more work that was done. Remember, this pack alone was almost 25 gigs in size as I remember and they're selling it for $9, a pretty good deal. Now talking about a different set of add-ons would be landmarks, they're not bad either. We have Orbex covering a good portion here at 30-33% to off. Now there are a few other landmarks including Dreswicky design. But honestly if you ask me, I didn't find any performance issues with Orbex. So I would always go with Orbex. With Dreswicky design I experienced a little bit of stutters which wasn't really a smooth experience. But I'd leave the landmarks portion to you to decide as we have so many regions when it comes to landmarks. Now when it comes to activities, we do see them here, but quite frankly we can find similar lines if you navigate to this website. I mean why pay for activities? World Tour Flights. This is a project built with great passion on flying. So big thanks to Blue Feather and the team to bring this user friendly web application helping us reach more and more wonderful destinations in the sim. This is a straightforward app that helps you choose the type of adventure you get towards. Now this has been supported by our own community members. You get to decide on what type of terrain you would like with a range of options here. Now you can choose tropics, mountains, valleys, landmarks, rivers, cities and more. And you get to choose another set of options to see how long you'd like to fly here. Ranging anywhere between 30 minutes going all the way to hours. You can find the link to World Tour Flights in the description below. It's a great app and a user friendly one. So take advantage of that. Now to conclude it, we have 950 items on sale. Most of them have offered us between 20 to 30% off. But there are a few items at almost 40% off and I think it's a better bang for your buck. Now the coolest deals if you ask me. Zenith Stole at $9.99, Simwork Studio 67% off. Same with the Kodiak 100 plus Orbex Mesh Terrains. I would always recommend something like this. Mesh Terrains guys, better bang for your buck easily. Now if you haven't tried any of these mesh terrains, try out the freeware from Orbex that offers Iceland. You can find the link to that freeware on the description to know what kind of change you can experience. Now this sale is active until the 4th of January. Take good advantage, don't splurge, rather pick the add-ons that you would think you would use them more often as they can give more value here. By the way, we always try to get the best out here to improve your experience at the sim. So consider subscribing as we intend to bring more content. We hope you like this video, there's so much more coming. Until next time, do take care.